Besides, you make the queens, queens, you heard me. And we go a little something like this. Hold on, brother. Ain't that much. You know, I'm just working on this new album coming out called okay. Underdog. Underdog. Under, the underdog. The Underdog. Wow. Yeah. What, what made you come with that album? Yeah, basically because that's that's the position I always had when I was in the Terror Squad. You know yeah. what I mean? I always had to wait for my turn. But at the same time, we all fought and fought and fought. That's why I'm still here now. Yeah. Right. And I'm a rep pun until the day is over. You know what I mean? Right. Definitely. Man, shout out. Man, rest in peace, big rest pun. Rest in peace, big pun. Can I just ask him triple safe? That means yes. triple six, like six, six, six. Yes. Are you a bad guy? <laughs> no, I'm just a beast. I All right. Know, you know, okay. Triple Shades come from a, a, a ruler named Nero Caesar. A lot see, of people don't know that. Mm -hmm. All right. See, that was a ruler who ran his country, and you couldn't say his name. So they put a number on him. His number was 666. He was a beast. So everything I ever did, Pum was like, yo, you a beast. But it, it yeah. was Sace. Then we did a freestyle for Tony Tatcha, and Tony said, yo, yo, what's up? What's your man's name right there? He said, yeah, yeah, that's Sace. Now nah, that's triple sace. Oh, okay. And that stuck oh, okay. with me right there. Pun just put the triple. Wow. What, I love what's it. what's the, your your the greatest memory of working with Big Pun? Period. Overall, either think, in the studio or wherever. Like, well, just what's your just us memory? battling on the phone or on a daily wow. phone call. We can never talk normal. Right. It's like, yo, what up? It's early in the morning. I can smack you with a cyber slap. I saw you right there with Shorty. I'm gonna clap your back. Oh wow! <laughs> it was never just going like that. Yeah, just, wow. He knew what time it was. As soon as what was the funniest ran. moment with Pun? Because Pun was like the wet a big dreams, joker. man. The wet dreams. Oh, yeah. exactly. and him, you fall asleep <laughs> at his house and have his son put on a boxer glove. And boom! Wake your ass up. <laughs> wow! 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 Did that's called the wet dream. No, nah, that was a, a sucker punch. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the wet dream was when you fall asleep. We throw a bucket of water on you. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's there's footage fun. out there. There's footage out there. <laughs> the whole Terror Squad movement. You know what yeah. I'm saying? It started with you and Pun, you know what I mean? And then Cuban everything, Link. Cuban Link. What happened with you and Joe? Well, what happened was when, when Pun passed away, he was the nucleus of the crew. Yes. So a lot of things went through Pun. And okay. so me and Cuban came with Pun. You know what I mean? So what happened was when he died, there was not enough strength or unity to keep the, the movement yeah. going. And why so, was that? you know, my, because you, you, you figure now him being in the head, yeah. the, the platinum artist. Who's going to come behind that? You know what I mean? The next yeah. person was supposed to come was Cuban Link. Yeah. But, you know, as as being a, a, a top management, he can't make that move. It's just sad that right now we can never come back together. If you look at Dipset Reunion. Yeah. If you look at The Woo is Back. Yeah. yeah. You look all about it from my era that was about lyrics and, and true music and yeah. hip-hop. We the only crew that can't never come back. So it's, it's, it's just sad mm. to say that. You know what I mean? So... It, it, what's the status on the terrorist squad? There's no affiliation with you and the terrorist squad no nah, more? I have, I have no affiliation with them. I have no animosity towards them. Right. Okay. Because when I left terrorist squad, I sat in front of Joe. Like we sitting right now. Yeah. So I'm, look, I already know where this is going. And, and if I'm going to do bad, I might as well do bad on my own. Yeah. So he was right. like, I right, do you, but you can't use no terrorist squad affiliate to get on. Wow. So, you know, it was all good. And wow. then, and then you feel some type of way. Like you kept it real with him. Like, yo, yeah. I, you know what I mean? I know how it's going, but. Just not using no terror squad. So, at that point, you really felt like it was no relationship with you and Joe. If he nah, said, it was, it was just basically you do you, and I do me. It was like a breakup with your yeah. girl. You still okay. got love for the girl, you know. You yeah. still got love for that person. Yeah. But it's over. You know what I mean? So you got to move on and, and mentally and do That's you right. your own things. You know what I mean? And I did a lot on my own. I dropped my own album. Yeah. I, I don't know how many other members did. Yeah. Uh, I dropped. A single through uh, Fat Beats with uh, Nelson. Nelson, okay. who runs uh, thisis50.com. Mm -hmm. yeah. Shout, Shout out to Nelson. Nelson. Shout out to you. <laughs> yeah, because you know what I mean? He put me in the path where I needed to be. Yeah. It was just Shout about Nelson, me, how bad man. I wanted it. You know what I mean? Yeah. How many How many members was the part it was, of Tell Squad? It was, that time? Uh, you had like six six of us. Yeah. Because you had Armageddon. Yeah. Uh, you had Cuban Link, Prospect, Triple Six, myself, Joe, and Pun. Right. But then we had Tony Sunshine, right. who wasn't signed to the group. But he was, uh, you know what I mean? He was an understu uh, understudy. What about yeah. Remy? Remy came through Pun. Like, he found him. Yeah. He was he signed to his label, the okay. foundation. All right. I mean, when he heard Remy, he was like, yo, we on. We about to do something big. Yeah. And right. that whole week, he planned it out. And then that Monday, he passed, yo. That's wow. crazy. Word. That's crazy. So did you ever know Remy or just, you know, like. Just oh, well, like I met her. I met her when he brought her to the house. You know yeah. What I mean? And that was it. When I met her, I was like. Yeah, yeah, this bitch is wow. She's real. Yeah. She got <laughs> yeah. bars. You know what I mean? Okay. And he put her on like the same way he got on. Yeah. The next day in the studio, boom, fire water. Next day she in the studio doing, doing that one song by herself. Wow. Mm -hmm. 
So, uh, what new projects do you have coming out? I know you got the, the, the album coming out. Yeah, the underdog. I'm also um, directing videos now. I did wow, one with uh, that uh, up, for man. Black, for up, Black Wall Street. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Black Wall Street, uh, my song just got signed again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was with, here yeah. last week. With there you us. go, with New Jersey Devil. I, I shot one of their videos. I did something for this upcoming artist called Jay Sun. Okay. Uh, everybody look out for that kid. He's, he's on next in line. All right. Uh, who is Jay All right. And I got some, I got Black Rob, Jada Kiss, Styles. Got things lined up. Wow, man. You know what I mean, so I'm, I'm just wow, working, trying to do what I should have done a long time ago. I Let's wanted go. to talk about how you, Pun, and Joe had a group. Right. What was that? Just well, we we was a group called Full of Clips before yes. we, you know Joe heard about us because we we Joe's from my neighborhood, so we was a group called Full of Clips. We battled everybody. We got in all the contests until we got into the uh, Bad Boy Crazy Sam contest in yeah, Victoria yeah. Five, <laughs> and then we was the only Spanish act in there, uh-huh. pun jumping off the stage at three hundred pounds. You know what I mean? <laughs> wow! And, and we did what what everybody else do to get on. We brought the whole block. Yeah. So yeah. our crowd was half for the Mobby. crowd. Yeah. Wow. As soon as we yeah. step up, it was. We they won. Know the song. <laughs> oh, we didn't even have to say a word. Yeah. <laughs> it's already crazy. <laughs> <laughs> the cliff, ah. yeah. And Joe saw that. So he was like, damn. And then we, when we got to the block, our man Little Hack, he said, yo, Joe, you got to hear these kids. And he was from, from there, it was like the next day in the studio. Wow. And Punch spit that, you know, I blow the moon out the sky and take, That's you know, crazy. throw the sun away. Let me ask you a question. Um, You know, when, when Punch when Pun passed and all that, I guess there was a lot of controversy with like where all his money went, his royalties went. Did Fat Joe have control of that at any point? I, I really or? can't answer that because I, I, don't, I don't know the specs as, as the black and white goes. Right. I know that Punk carried the cross to say that he gave up 50% yeah. of everything. Right. You know yeah. what I mean? So that being said, you still got something there. You know what I mean? Right. Now it's on you as a man to do what you're supposed, supposed to, to do, do if that's your brother. You know what I mean? Right. So yeah. I'm not going to take it beyond black and white because at the end of the day, that's why you get a lawyer. That's why you get these people to yeah. get your money. Because if yeah. it's there, you're going to get it. If it's not, it's not there. You know what I mean? How do you feel about the documentary upon um, his wife put Was out? Was it represented you know, right? Well, the first one kind of bothered me because, you know, you know the part that, you know, the, the, the domestic violence yeah. part. You know, nobody knew that about Pun, about yeah. his music. Exactly. Everybody loved his music. Yeah. So for it to come out first, it was like, it was kind of disturbing. Yeah. Not only to the fan, but to myself. Like, damn. You know what I mean? His name could be hurt now. No sponsor might not want to put up no money now. Yeah. Nobody could throw a, a get an all day on MTV I don't now. Think you would think yeah. About you know that. what I mean? That, this is why these things is going on. They be like, yo, but why you don't see Pun on the radio all day, or why you don't hear him? Because it's these type of it. obstacles that whoever wants to back that has to go over that's just true. to make it happen. That's true. Word. This is your nephew. This is my blood. So yeah. that's what's up, man. You got a smile on my face. <laughs> I see, I see. Yeah. Yeah. So this is your first break right here, man. Hey, man. You be the judge, man. Love, you got something for us? Me, have you walking on a tight rope? Turn a ship into a lifeboat. You wondering how this ain't coming out of my throat? Something that I wrote, folded up in my coat. Worry about them hounds. Got grams in the pound, got guns with automatic sound, uh. taking over town, then states, looking around while everybody waits. Okay. What you know about me? Right. Me, turn the closet to a fuck space, turn the grill to a fuck space. Ah. No time for them duck chase. Bitch, get on your knees and lick on the nut paste. You don't want beef, you want grief. Charlie Brown rappers complaining about underneath. You don't want mine, you want yours to be as good as mine so you can get applause. Yeah, yeah, man. Like give, it up, man. give it up for okay, reason, man. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. What you know about me. I like yeah. that. What you know about <laughs> me. Man. Me. He bringing that energy, twice. man. So That's what's up. You got a Twitter, you know what I mean? Yeah, Website, yeah everybody you know what I mean? get at me at TripSaceBX okay. at, at Twitter. And then you got the little Facebook. Hit me on there. And basically, my, my website right now that I'm launching is Latin yeah. is Platinum.